Captain Logan arrived at Moreton Bay in the year 1826. The convict settlement was only a collection of rough huts lacking essential facilities such as showers, toilets, a school and a hospital. Within four years, the number of convicts arriving at the settlement jumped from around 200 people to more than 1,000 people. A convict is a person found guilty of a criminal offence and serving a sentence of imprisonment. Captain Logan wanted to improve the living conditions for convicts arriving to Wharton Bay in the hopes that they would continue to work hard for the captain. In coping with these problems, Captain Logan's skills as a manager became very evident. He created a large settlement of brick and stone buildings, complete with a school and a hospital. He also built a jail and a military barracks. As you can see from the pictures, these are some of the original buildings still standing today. This was a fantastic achievement for Captain Patrick Logan. It would have been extremely hard to build these buildings in that time. As you can see, the brick and stone would have been extremely heavy to carry. Now it's time for your second inquiry question. What year did Captain Patrick Logan arrive in Moreton Bay? Remember, if you can't find the evidence, go back to the start of the video and listen carefully. Also remember to record these in your inquiry questions answer sheet. Good luck! Once you've completed inquiry question two, get ready for inquiry question three. Captain Patrick Logan built many buildings made from bricks and heavy stone. What were some of the main buildings that he built? Name them. Remember, if you can't find the evidence, go back to the beginning of the video and listen carefully. There are at least four, so remember to record these in your inquiry questions answer sheet. Good luck!